everybody! I'm just quick filming an unboxing of my subscriptions. I have a mystery kit subscription and a doodle kit subscription. I am the owner of Thumbprints Co. in case you aren't subscribed for that reason. So first I will do, I will unveil my doodle kit. It is, well, I'll wait and show you the theme. I Every month I do a piece of cardstock that's that goes along with the theme. A lot of people use it for like dashboards or just punching it and putting their planner, decoration, whatever. I think it's super cute. I've actually been punching mine and putting them in my personal. So anyway, this one says wee wee because it is obviously Paris themed and I'm in love with it. So I also include post-its in every doodle kit and these are just black and white, very graphic. These are actually my favorite ones so far. They're always kind of, the doodle ones are much more graphic than the mystery kit ones just because they're doodle kit based. So they're usually more black and white, more graphic, like I mentioned. And these are my little Frenchmen, <laughs> little like doodle, French little doodle emojis. They're super cute. I'm obsessed with them. I did, um, last month was like a treat yourself theme and I did uh, little doodle emojis with crowns on them. So I thought I'd carry the theme through and make them little French dudes. So my favorite one is him because he's so whiny and he's hilarious. So anyway, I have all these little treats like French treats and they're super tasty looking. And I also have more fashion based ones with heels, dresses, purses, super cute. And poodle doodles, which are just awesome because they're poodle doodles, oodles of poodle doodles. So, and then I have Eiffel Towers, obviously. But yeah, super cute. And then lots of little quotes or phrases like Parisian type of things, French things. So, all very cute. I always have five sheets. In here, obviously, my doodles are all hand drawn by me. So, so yeah, I always have five sheets in my doodle kit, along with a paper good like this. I think it's it's always been sticky notes so far. I don't know for sure if I'll keep up with that, but it'll always be at least sticky notes, if not something bigger and better. But I love sticky notes. I use them all the time, so that's why I have them in everything. So. So yeah, five sheets of doodles. I have the doodle emojis, treats, clothing like fashion, poodle doodles and Eiffel Towers and quotes. So yeah, that is my Paris themed May doodle kit. Super cute, always comes in like a chevron bag like this. And a lot of people buy it along with my mystery kit, which I will show you in just a second. So. My mystery kit actually comes in two, well, three different sizes. Uh, most popular are the personal sized and the vertical. For its size for the vertical Erin Condren. So I will actually grab another bow just because there were two options and I would like to show you both of them. All right, here is the pink one. So I actually teamed up with the paper unicorns. Uh, Melanie, I'm really good friends with her in real life, like outside of the planner community, I guess, but she makes these adorable bows and everybody I've shown these to loves them. And I'm so happy that they, that they've actually found her and love her bows as much as I do because they're super cute. She is really talented. And look at the adorable little cutie. He's so fat and cute. It's adorable. But yeah, Love her stuff, love her shop. She has lots of different options for colors and everything, and they're all very sturdy. Like, that's one of my favorite things about them is because I'm always nervous about clips that they're going to break, but obviously these are soft and they mold, like they travel really well with the planner, and they're just adorable. That's the main thing. So yeah, so I teamed up with her, and these match so well. Like, we didn't think they would match as well as they did, but they totally did. So. So yeah, uh, one of the, you get one of these with the kit. It was either color. We had half and half. So um, also post-its, like I mentioned with the doodle kit. I also include post-its with the mystery kit, and they're just they say you got this with the little foiled lip print on there. 
So then I also include this. It's cardstock, double sided. I leave it unpunched so that people with A5 planners can punch it for their own needs, but it is sized to be a personal size dashboard or like divider, whatever you want. But yeah, super cute. I always make them match the kit and they also kind of hide the kit when you're first opening it up, adds to the suspense. So this is the personal kit. These are the main two pages with lots of super tiny decorative stickers. I have a weekend banner, happy mail payday, a mini little planner right there, lots of flags, lots of checklists, and let's see here. Lots of tiny icons, my favorite, and lots of little decorative stickers. I try to keep them small too just for extra small planners. And half boxes and quarter boxes. Um, these are also shared in the other kits and little things. So yeah, lots of stickers. Um, most people have mentioned that they can spread this out over multiple weeks because there's so many stickers in here, which is awesome to hear because that means it's a good deal. So yeah, so you get this, the dashboard type of thing and sticky notes and a bow, super cute. So, and then also this month I started giving out business cards with the link to my subs club section of my site where you can purchase items from previous kits and that includes sticky notes, like leftover sticky notes and um, all the leftover doodles and stuff like that from old doodle kits. So yeah, anyway, um, same kind of deal with the vertical kit. You get a bow, either color, sticky notes, you get this little dashboard type of thing, but then... Oh, you also get the half boxes and little things. And then also you get date covers right here and decorative, more icons. And then this is the same format as my full kit that's in my shop. So my full kits are all the same type of thing so you know what to expect. And then you get all eight full boxes, you get all of your headers, you get all of these little half boxes, the like checklist half boxes, all of your checklist flags, little icons, you get planner, payday, happy mail, me, circle, and stuff like that. So yeah, if you've gotten my full kits before, you know what to expect. But you get your bottom washi nice and thick, lots of solid washi. I thought it'd be a little too much to have patterned. And then little tiny dots up there. And lots of ombre checklist boxes, sidebar, habit tracker, blank header, and yeah, so that's it. It's seven pages, like four of these big sheets and three of the little quarter sheets like this. So yeah, I love this kit. It's actually one of my favorites. Like it's between this and my last kit. My, actually I'm not sure. It might also be the Cardinal kit, my first kit. So, so yeah, same kind of dealio as the uh, personal kit. You get all of these little extras too. So a lot of people order them together with the doodle kit. But yeah, I just thought I'd give you guys a little sneak peek in case you haven't already subscribed. Or if you have, just to look at it again. So, <laughs> um, but yeah, I am really happy with how it turned out. I'm really excited that everybody seems to like it so much, which is awesome. It's always awesome, awesome because I make all my own artwork and it's a really personal thing. So. Thanks so much for watching. I hope you liked them. And make sure to check back. Uh, follow me on, th on Instagram as thumbprints underscore co. I always give updates on there for when the subscriptions are going live. And yeah, so the next ones will be going live on the 20th. They always go li live on the 20th of every month. And they ship out around the 1st. So yeah, um, feel free to leave a comment below if you have any questions about the kit. I really hope you want to subscribe. And if you have, thank you so much for subscribing. So... Thank you so much for watching and bye.